I'm Kevin. And we're from Lauder Life. Today we are doing Vlogmas number six. Six. Number Yay. six. We already have our company over here breathing on my leg. He is ready for his. <laughs> Hi, Jackie boy. He's here for Vlogmas. Hi, Yay. Jackie He's boy. excited for Vlogmas. He is ready for his. You yeah. want to do his? Vlogmas? Yeah, let's do his. And it's uh, the St. Bernard today, right there, number six, the St. Bernard. All right. So let's do that. Jack, you are excited about the St. Bernard's oh, today, Oh, look at you. got to see his little face. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's so cute. He is, is so ready. Funny. It's your favorite time, isn't it? It's your favorite time. <laughs> yes, please. Look at that sweet little face. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. He is just well, the sweetest Well, it doesn't take boy. much to make them happy. I'm telling you. All right. All right, what kind so of coffee, coffee are we having today? Coffee. I already started right. the coffee maker. Number six, where are we at? Number, Number six. six, top, six top row, top. up here on the top row. Number six. Okay, we are uh, New Orleans, something or other. New Orleans. Stand by. Hold this phone. All right. Let's put that over there. It is a New Orleans organic Newman's special blend. I'm not sure what to think about organic. that. Organic. Yeah. So. New Orleans. Kevin Seminary is in New Orleans. That's right. Organic, uh, yeah. it says Newman's Special Blend. So we're gonna have to try that right. and see what that looks like. Let's go start it up. Autumn made some yummy cookies. Those look delicious. All right, let's see. Did you already do that? Mm -hmm. It's already gone. Smells organic. What does organic smell like? It actually smells like a <laughs> A boulder blend. Like it's more, it's rich, very rich. Oh, so it's gonna be strong. It sounds like it's gonna be strong. I don't like strong coffee. Yeah. Definitely, definitely a hearty blend. Yeah, this is what Starbucks coffee smells like. With, uh, you know, without the, all the poo poo stuff in it. All right. Well, I like poo poo. And this is hazelnut with a um, Splenda. Oh, look at the swirl. That is neat. Look at that. It's pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. All yeah. right. Not bad. I mean, it's not bad. Okay, I'll taste it over there. Okay. Time to taste the coffee. <laughs> it smells good. Mm -hmm. That's just me. Yeah, it's strong. You drank that whole cup, you're up all night, Jack. You'd be like, Mah! No. Yeah. Yeah, you like a light blend. I might prefer a light blend as well. This is definitely a dark blend. Yeah, it's it's hearty. So. Hardy. Hardy yeah. coffee. That's right. So all right. Well that's that. And now let's do Star Wars. Alright, so I like that how we did that together. Number six. We could sing together. Number six. Number six. There it's right there in the middle. It's right here, number six, and oh, a little Darth Vader. Darth Vader. That's the real deal, Darth Vader. Ooh. All right, there you go. I wonder if the other one wasn't really like Darth Vader. The one with the uh, the other night. The, no, that's not Darth Vader. That's not. That's a that's a stormtrooper. No, it's not a stormtrooper. Yeah, he's a dark stormtrooper. Look at the helmet. You're gonna have to ask Corey. He's kind of yeah. He has a helmet like a stormtrooper. Oh, he's the, uh, the newest one with the pilot. He's a pilot. You see the glasses? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know his name. I, I wish they, it, yeah, yeah, I wish they told us. She had the names on them. Those of us that are uninformed. Oh, right there. Oh, of course it did. No, it's in a different language. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's in a different language. For real? Yeah. Oh, it is for real. Yeah, I don't read that language. language. Oh, well. So, anyway, all right. So we'll put him over here. We'll ask our son and give you a report back. Maybe you know who it is. You can put it um, on the chat in the in the bottom. All right, time for some makeup. Yay! I love you. All right, this is day number six. What we got? What we got? What we got? Ooh. It's a brow highlighter. 
Oh, we need that. Can I try it on you? A brow highlighter. Okay. I prefer the unibrow. So brow. this <laughs> actually would go like right underneath the brow here. Wow. Who knew? Mm -hmm. Man. Let me see. I'd like to try that. My, I've never tried one. Okay. My life is complete now. I have seen the brow highlighter. <laughs> All right. I tell you. I got some stuff. This is like a pretty big product. I know. Maybe getting closer to Christmas, the products are getting a little bit bigger. I don't know. Ulta is awesome. Very cool. All right, that is my product for today. Yay! All right, so let's talk about today. No, today no, no, has no, no, been no, no, like no, no, extremely no, 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 busy no, no, too. We can't yet. We didn't get our socks. We got people asking us about socks, man. It's hilarious. At church, around town, people are saying, okay, what, let me see your socks. Today I was at a party. I had to pull my socks up. It was kind of awkward, but it was cool. It was not. He loved it. All right. Let's see what this one is. Oh, snowflakes. All right. And who? Ah. Yep, snowflakes. That's kind of cool. Oh, those are cute. Yeah, with reindeer flying on them. And I think that's a city or something. Yeah, yeah it's a little house. Yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Those are super cute, right? Cool. All right. Those are cute. These. And as a reindeer, see the reindeer? I will definitely be wearing these this weekend. That's awesome. You're maybe, a cute one. Maybe in the pulpit. Who knows? I'll show you my socks to this weekend, okay? Yeah, watch online. First Baptist Church Palm Coast Facebook page. <laughs> Let's see who we got. Mickey! Mickey Mouse! All right. I love Mickey. Hi, Mickey. Oh, wow, those are long socks, I will too. definitely be wearing these. Those are big. I might steal those. Those are nice. You can't steal my socks. Yeah, you got cute socks I like all those. week. Yeah. These are cute. Those aren't many. Those are Mickey's. Mickey's. I think they're supposed to be for me. All Put right. So. There. All right. So lots of stuff happened today. What happened today? <laughs> what did we start out doing? We started out <laughs> super early. He got so me out of bed. Early. At like oh dark early, it we was, were at there's Panera no at six thirty before the door opened at Panera. I was there, and he got us up, but for a good reason. So um, we brought lunch yesterday. We brought no, we didn't bring breakfast. Lunch. Yesterday we brought uh, breakfast to the preschool department for our our school, First Baptist Christian Academy, and then today we brought breakfast for our um, what is it, kindergarten through twelfth grade um, teachers, yeah. So we have two campuses for the academy, a north and a south campus. On the north campus, all the preschoolers, probably 60, 70, 80 munchkins up there and uh, 10 or 15 staff members. So yesterday we did that. We were down in the south campus today with about 60 staff members and had breakfast with them. Yeah. So, I mean, it was a lot of fun because we don't get to see them all in one place no. or really get to enjoy their company. But they are amazing, amazing yes. people. Yes, yep, every day, day in and day out, yeah. they serve our children, they share Jesus with them, they are amazing. And then we went from there. Um, I had to run around and we had to go finish getting a couple presents because today was the staff lunch for the staff at First Baptist church yeah for my church staff. so um i had to get a couple of gift cards and then finish with the wrapping and um then we went and had lunch with them did today. you take any pictures there i did we can put them right there <laughs> The wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy Standing up close by the Christmas tree Glimmering light, I am right where I want to be I will be home for a couple of days Wander around with you You and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true Wherever I go, I got Let's say Italian. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we can do that. I think I even took a little video, so I'll put awesome. that there. And we were able to pick up our sweet granddaughter from 
preschool today Yay. at 11.30. We cool. picked her up, and um, her mama had to do um, car riders at the North Campus. Is that South, South Campus? Campus? South, South Campus. Campus. Yeah, she had to do a, a car riders at the South Campus. So we picked her up and spent a half hour, 45 minutes with her until her, her mom could come pick her up. And then we enjoyed a really nice lunch. Kathleen uh, put on a uh, really nice amazing. lunch. Amazing. Uh, for the staff, and that was really beautiful and um, delicious. Very, very good. And then she had like somebody make these mm. chocolate bombs. Where'd they get the, where, We mm. have them here. Uh, it's over there on the counter. I'll show you. The cho they're chocolate bombs, so you put them in, so you um, put them inside of a coffee cup, and then you pour hot milk or hot water on it, whichever you would prefer. And the chocolate melts right into the, the water. Look at this. These are fabulous. Oh, well, it kind of got turned over. Well, see, it got turned over. Let me open it, because I want to show you. So I tricked with these things. Okay. It's a really cool little box. I don't want to break it. Break it. This cool. Wow. So you put this in your coffee mug and then you pour hot. Oh, there's something in there too. You pour hot milk over the top and it's hot chocolate. Yeah, hot chocolate bombs. How many carbs are there? Oh, this? don't even ask. That's not even funny. But this looks delicious. Yeah. I'm not eating it. You're, you're going to eat it and we're all going to enjoy it. Watching you drink it. Um, okay. Or at I'll least take we have one for to the do team. it. Yeah, take one for the I'll team. I'll take one for the team. Okay. All right. So, um, anyway, that was gorgeous. And then she we ordered she ordered us um, carabas. Was it carabas? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So carabas. So it was parm good. parmesan chicken and lasagna and Oops. some ziti and big ziti mm -hmm. breadsticks. Those breadsticks were like to die for. They look I don't think I've eaten those before. That was. That was awesome. They looked really, really good. And then uh, we exchanged some gifts, and that was fun. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then afterwards, we had to go back to the, well, we came home for a little while. Yeah. Maybe an hour for a little and a half. Mm -hmm. And then we had to go back to the church because he had a wedding rehearsal. So from five to six, he did a wedding rehearsal. And then we went over to our friend's house, Rosa, and they have a wonderful Sunday school, a women's Sunday school class, and their husbands were invited today. So, so I got to go. Um, <laughs> we went over there and had a delicious dinner. Oh, yeah, it was really um, good. But it was so good because we never get the opportunity to sit around and just um, chat with everybody, and we were able to see them and spend some time with them and their whole Sunday school class. And they have a fabulous Sunday yeah. school class. That beautiful was home, fun. Rosa. Beautiful uh, Hostess, environment. Yeah. Uh, excellent food. Excellent people. So you guys are amazing. Thank you. After that, we had um, ran over to another friend's house, Donna Collison, and I do have video of this. No, of amazing. Look there. She. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Let's go to the ocean. Yeah, let's go outside. We can hang out on the beach with our free. That amazing in Christmas times. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time. Santa's coming to visit No, he would
Did you see it? Yeah. So, well, um, she they, she created this village on her own, Insane. and she has done the research, and um, so crafty. Crafty. If you look at the little details, like there's like um, where there's um, carrots that they've planted. You know, it looks like they've just been pulled from a garden that are sitting in a bowl. It's incredible and grapes, detail. Grapes, and you just got to really pay attention to the detail. But it is absolutely, absolutely fabulous. Every year, she builds onto it, and she does this um, really gorgeous buffet um, for whoever stops by to visit. Um, what yeah. a great hostess she is. She's amazing. Yeah. She actually made a temple or a, um, a temple building out of or old Oreo boxes and styrofoam cooler. It's just insane. Spray painted it. it you never looks, know that it, that's what it was. That's for sure. So creative. Unbelievably creative. So. Yeah, she did amazing. Amazing. You'll see some of these features. Even the water features that she had done like look like yeah. water, like you know, the different features of the color yeah. waters, I mean, the different hues, you know, how you get the darker, lighter, um, gorgeous. It looked so real. I mean, this is something that should really You be know, I would be impressed if uh, we gave her our Star Wars figurines that we're doing for Advent and see if she can work them into the village. <laughs> no. That'd be awesome. No. That'd be awesome. No. This is gorgeous. Wait till you see it. And by now you have seen it. It is so awesome mm -hmm. it is really yep. incredible and then we ended our night um just a few actually minutes ago. we stopped by racetrack and got a soda and a little cup of frozen yogurt and um then we ran over to our friends uh leslie um their daughter and our son um are married and um jesse from japan sent this huge package to us uh, full of gifts for us and her family. So um, we ran over their gifts so that they had their, their gifts. And she was, they were so sweet to us. So, so sweet to us. She had a present for us. And it's one of my favorite things in the whole wide world. Can you guess? <laughs> is that the cutest thing you have awesome. ever seen? I mean, it is so cute. It's an ornament for... But this is obviously a carnival ship and is for the tree. They were just on the magic um, last month. Yeah. Was it last uh, month? Yeah, when we were on the Mardi Gras the last time, they were on the magic. So at the end of last month, end yeah. of November, they were on right after the magic. Mm -hmm. And the magic is one of our favorites. <clears throat> that, from all the ones that we have been on, yep. the magic has been our favorite. Even after being on the Mardi Gras, yep. the magic is still our favorite. But is that the cutest? That is so sweet. You want to give us a thumbs up? You love that, don't you? Isn't All that right. cute? Mm -hmm. Don't you want to go cruising? Yeah, let's go now. All right. Soon enough. That's so awesome. that has been our incredibly busy day. Busy, busy, busy. And now we are here doing Advent with you. And that's right. That's what we've done today. Yeah, that's what we've done today. So I just have a quick verse that is really the, the crux of the Christmas story. It is the... Uh, emphasis is when Jesus was born. Uh, Luke chapter 2 is the story we've been reading it for the last couple of days, talking about where, uh, when it was when Caesar Augustus declared a, a decreed a census should be taken. They had to go back to uh, from Nazareth to Bethlehem. So we have the when and the where, and now the what. The what is Jesus was born. And so in verse 6 of chapter 2, it says, while they were there, meaning in Bethlehem, doing the census while they were there, the time came for the baby to be born. And she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in clothes and placed him in a manger because there was no guest room available for them. And so this is the everything about the Christmas story that most of you know. Uh, the manger scene, uh, because there was no room in the inn, they had to be in a manger. Baby was born, uh, placed in a trough, a feeding trough because there wasn't any room for them. And so, uh, just an amazing story. The King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, comes and is born as a baby in a manger, in a feeding trough for animals, instead of in a palace or a kingdom. And so, it just shows the humble beginnings of Jesus, 
but the the incredible richness of God's plan of redemption. And so tomorrow, you don't want to miss tomorrow. Tomorrow we're going to talk about the angels, right? The shepherds and the watching their flocks by night. The angels show up and just blast everything wide open. And so I'm going to have a party tomorrow. All right? All right. So one thing that I did not mention is that in between running around, going to everybody's houses and visiting and enjoying ourselves this evening, we saw Christmas lights. Yeah. So we are going to oh, end yeah, our night. Cool. Yeah. Those are Wasn't cool. it cool? Yeah. Um, so we're going to end our night and we're going to show you those lights right here. All right. We're coming up to some more lights with the um, lights that move to the music. Are they laser lights? All right, so we're back. I hope that you enjoyed those. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed. Push that hit, like button. Hit the like button. And hit the bell so that you get notified every time that we put something on the channel. So thanks so much for joining us, and we will see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.